today I'm here with electrician Mr. Jared Marmot. Hello. Thank you for coming. Yes. So um, what was your first job and how old were you? Well, the first job was pretty boring, so we'll talk about the more fun job, film production. <laughs> okay. Um, what did you do? Did you work on the set? Yes, um, I worked both on and uh, behind the scenes of set. Okay. And how did you get this job? Uh, it was pretty easy because a friend of mine was working for a company in uh, Connecticut here and they were in need of extras, so okay. we got on that through that way. And you were there transportation issues? or No, I had to drive, drive up the Berlin Turnpike to get to the uh, set. And that okay. was, wasn't too bad. Um, was it what you expected? I didn't know what to expect because, you know, I've never been on a set prior to that and I've always dreamed of being in movies and, you know, lo and behold, there you go. So what's your most memorable experience? My most memorable experience on set was the movie we did in Rhode Island last year where we had Tony Todd, Sully Erna from Godsmack, and David Chokichi from Baywatch, and we also had Michael Berryman, who was uh, in all the horror movies. That was, a, that was a good time on set. You're an electrician. Is that what you wanted to be growing up? I wanted to be a tow truck driver when I was a kid. Yeah. Any reason why, or you just thought it was cool? It was cool. When you're a kid, you just see, like, oh, wow, look at that. <laughs> did your first job influence your future job experience? Yeah, it's a little both, because like, uh, I was actually doing electrical before I got into the film, okay. so, but uh, but uh, the two kind of correspond with each other a little bit, if I try to get into more lighting of sets. Right. If you could describe it in one word, what would it be? Showbiz. <laughs> um, if you could do it all over again, would you choose the same job? Yeah, it's actually cool. It's fun. It's got its moments, good and bad, but for the most part, it's kind of cool. And do you have any success tips for the future generations getting their first job? Yes, get off those dang computers and actually work with your hands for a living. <laughs> well, once again, this is Mr. Jared Marmot, and thank you so much. Thank you. All right.